Cool, and we're live. Welcome back to another live stream, guys. Today we're doing a simple Q&A as I play some Minecraft. So I'm gonna go ahead and wait a few minutes for people to join the stream, and then we will go ahead and get started. And guys, as you stream in, go ahead and ask any questions you have about homework, college applications, study tips, pretty much whatever comes to mind. Uh, this is a late night stream, so it's gonna be a bit more chill, but hopefully I can still go ahead and answer all of your guys' questions. All right, what's up? We have Anthony, Jaden, Top G, Aya, Sai, Izzy, Peach, What's up, guys? Thank you for tuning in. Welcome back to another live stream. Guys, go ahead and start asking your questions in the stream chat. You can ask about homework, about study tips, about college apps, about anything. I think this is like one of our first few streams on a weekend. So hopefully some of you guys still get the chance to tune in. Let's see. How are you so bad at the game? <laughs> Demon, I'm sorry. Well, the thing is, I'm okay at Minecraft if I'm like not streaming at the same time. I feel like answering questions and doing this kind of makes it a bit hard. What's up, Benjamin? What's up, bro? What's up, uh, Nighty? Hello, hello. What's up, guys? Thank you for tuning in. Are you still in college? No, I graduated a couple years ago. I went to MIT and I studied, uh, I studied two things. I studied computer science and pretty much business. Uh, the full majors are computer science, data, or... Um, Computer science, data science, and business, uh, business analytics. All right, let's see, join a video. Can I join a video sometime? I might stream with some of you guys on like a different server or like a public server maybe. All right, how was your experience at MIT? It was very challenging. I can dive more into that if you guys want me to, but guys, go ahead and ask your questions. What's your career path? So I do social media and then I also run Next Adnet, which is a college admissions business. Uh, that side of the business, I don't talk about too much on like my in my content, but it involves a ton of computer science, a lot of coding, and I feel like that's where like my MIT education <laughs> kind of comes more into play. Uh, homework tips, please. I'll dive into that in just a little bit, but I'm gonna go ahead and answer a couple quick questions first. Let's see, what's up, what's up, JS Tries, great to see you again. Let's see, I'm from elementary school. Okay, so I'm curious, what like, are you guys in middle school or high school? Go ahead and post that in the stream chat, I'm kinda curious. And as I'm answering your questions, I'm gonna go ahead and try to build a house as well. So. Let's see, what are you guys saying? Middle school or high school, what do we think? What's up, what's up, what's up, Soap today? Thank you for tuning in. I think I saw Pop Linda tune in as well. Th oh, great to see you again. What's up, what's up? Seventh grade, middle school, high school. Okay, so I feel like it's like half and half right now. Yeah, I feel like my audience used to be like exclusively high school students, like juniors and seniors, but then over time, uh, more and more like middle school, or middle school students and younger students kind of came into play as well. That is pretty impressive. And guys, if you are just tuning in, once again, go ahead and ask any of your questions in the stream chat. I'll go ahead and do my best to answer as many questions as I possibly can. And maybe later on in the stream, we'll also go ahead and start doing some uh, some Kahoot or something else as well that's like more interactive. Go hard, find diamonds. Should I just go ahead and try to find diamonds? Am I out of wood already? You know what? I don't have enough wood, but I have a bed. Let me go ahead and place the bed maybe here. Uh, actually, I'll take it with me. You know what? Screw it. Uh, I think we'll build the house later. What do you guys want to do? Should I go ahead and like find diamonds or should I build the house? Go ahead and post what you want me to do in the stream chat. Let's see. What's your sport? I didn't do too many sports uh, in high school. Like I go to the gym nowadays, but back in high school, I did cross country and track for a little bit. Didn't really uh, continue with that though. Let's see. People are saying... House, okay, you know what? I'm gonna have to go ahead and do a poll. So I'm gonna go ahead and do a poll. Uh, house or diamonds? House, it's a very like, <laughs> I'm not too descriptive in the poll, but by house, you know, I mean build a house and by diamonds, I mean find diamonds. So go ahead, guys, go ahead and vote. And let's see, how much time is needed to learn six chapters? I'm gonna go ahead and just assume that you're reading like a standard textbook. Six chapters is gonna take quite, <laughs> quite some time, especially if you're trying to study it for an exam. If you're trying to study six chapters worth of content, I'm also imagining all the vocab words that you have to memorize, like all the main concepts that you kind of have to think through. Honestly, I would give yourself like a, at least a week to kind of just digest everything, maybe one chapter a day. And then like the seventh day could be like a review day of some sort. Let's see, what is in the lead? We have diamonds. Okay, diamonds is in the lead. So I think we'll go ahead and try to find diamonds. Uh, I'll take the bed with me. You know what, let me just... I want to break some trees. Do I have enough wood? I, actually, no, I think it's fine. We'll get like cobblestone as we're mining. Let me just get these cows though as I'm walking by. Uh, we already have a decent amount of food, but just to be safe. All right, here we go. What other questions do you guys have about homework, about study tips? Let's see, let's see. How do I study 14 subjects? Uh, if by 14 subjects you mean like 14 chapters worth of content, then at least give yourself like 
two and a half weeks. But if, if you're saying 14 like actual subjects, then it's gonna you're gonna have to spend way more time. Uh, let's see what other questions do we have? Uh, do, 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 how to improve at trig? I think when it comes to math in general, practice problems, it, it's the, pretty much the key. You have to do as many practice problems as you possibly can. And then you also have to be very, very aggressive when it comes to correcting your mistakes. So you kind of have to, you know, like analyze your mistakes, but then like, don't be too easy on the, giving yourself excuses, right? Don't just be like, oh, that was a dumb mistake or I wasn't trying or whatever it is. If you get a question wrong, actually try to figure out the core reason that you got it wrong. Like tr retrace your steps, do the question again, you know, like write out the explanation. And we got a $2 super chat. Thank you so much, Nura or Toma. Uh, $2, were your parents strict? I will be honest, let me, let me tell you guys about my parents. They were not that strict. And I think to a degree, you know, like there are scenarios where like parents are super strict and tell their kids like exactly what to do. And I see that I see this turn out in like one of two ways, right? If you have strict parents, you either are like a super genius, right? And you like just get straight A's, you have like perfect extracurriculars, you're kind of just crushing it in school. The other path that I see is students who just like burn out, right? Who can't kind of take the pressure. And it's totally fair, right? They kind of end up not caring about school because they were like forced to care about school for so, so long. Um, but my parents were not strict. I feel like they cared about school. They instilled, you know, great values. They kind of, you know, emphasized the importance of school while I was growing up, but they weren't like, go hard. You have to do like these crazy Olympiads and summer programs and you have to do research. I feel like all of that kind of came internally as I just saw people online, like getting into Harvard and doing these crazy activities. And I was like, dang, I really want to do that stuff uh, myself as well. And so that was really just kind of internalized, came from within. And I think my brothers are the same way. They kind of very much just picked up on these like sort of uh, habits themselves. Let's see, go high from the mobs. Yeah, I'm not really paying too much attention to the game. Guys, what other questions do you have? I like that question a lot. I want you guys to ask like juicy questions, if that makes sense. You know, like questions that aren't like super simple to answer that might, you know, n not be controversial, but you know, like will lead to a pretty interesting conversation. Get a shield. I should make a shield. Here, here, here. Let me go ahead and make a shield real quick. I don't have enough iron for that though, right? Or do I? Do I need like two? I forget how to make a. Is it? Can someone paste the like the shield crafting recipe in the chat? Just tell me what it is, basically. And we got another two dollars super chat. Thank you so much. Uh, what do we have over here? I uh, hopefully it's a juicy question. Do you like parodies? I don't watch that many parodies. I feel like back in the day though, back in like 2010, early YouTube, I feel like parodies like were the thing. Like every single music video, like a week later, there would be like a parody on YouTube. There was like this one guy, I think his name was like Shmo Yoho or something like that. He would post like the craziest like parodies back in the day. All right, I think I gotta take a break from the stream. Did you guys see that super chat? Did you guys see that super chat? Parodies, nuts. <clears throat> I'll be right back. Oh, no. <sighs> Bro, you actually get you, you got me like talking about parodies, like legitimately. That was, uh, that was, that was unfortunate. Okay. If you guys have actual questions, <laughs> feel free to post them in the stream chat. Again, any questions about like, uh, you know, that, that'll spur like interesting conversations. Okay, and did someone post like the crafting recipe for a shield? Let me go ahead and see. What do we have? What do we have? Okay, I think I'll have to go ahead and Google it myself. Let me see. Shield, shield uh, crafting recipe. Okay, so it's, oh, it's only one iron. Okay, I see, interesting. So let's go ahead and do that real quick. Iron and wood, yeah, yeah, I thought it was like two iron for some reason. Okay, any, duh, 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 what other questions do we have? Shout out to KP Gaming, thank you for tuning in. What is the best website to use for learning? Okay, I'll be honest about the websites that I used, and this isn't sponsored. I'll like legitimately give you guys my honest answers. Oh, it was uh, two more. There we go, perfect. And let's just throw this wool out, we don't really need it. Okay, so the websites that I mainly used back in high school, to be honest, I used a ton of Quizlet for pretty much everything. For like, 
A push for AP Psych. Um, I would pretty much prioritize vocab a lot while studying, so that was a big website for me. I would also use Todoist to kind of keep track of my to-do list. I didn't use Google Calendar that much in high school, but I use it a lot now. So uh, Chloe is asking, who is your favorite YouTuber? My favorite YouTuber right now? That is a really good question. I feel like it has to be Ryan Trahan. I feel like Ryan's videos are always just so wholesome. They're like energizing um, and they're fun. Like they're very unique each time. So I really do enjoy that. Okay, so you guys said find diamonds. So we're gonna have to go ahead and find a deeper cave. We have a, a shield now, which is good. Let's see, so we have, I think we have everything we need to go caving. I wanna get more iron though, and I wanna make a bucket, and I wanna get some water actually. So just in case we fall, I can like water bucket. Okay. To do what other questions do we have? Please make a video about students' uh, room and advantages of it. Oh, by that do you mean like how to set up your room? Like how to kind of like, like a desk setup of sorts? Okay, let's just go ahead and fight this zombie real quick. Okay, so let me go ahead and see. Do I have any iron ore? Oh, I have nine iron ore. So let me just go ahead and smelt some iron. Let's see. Uh, K, Q, 5 Z. I'm not going to fall for that this time. Um, here, okay, let me just go ahead and smelt this. Let's go ahead and split this in half, split this in half. Okay. Let's see, what other questions do we have? Do, do, do. Go ahead, kill the mobs. <laughs> I'm trying, I think, I think we're, we're surviving right now, so we're good. Do you have tips for coding? That's interesting. So back in the day, I used Code Academy a fair amount, um, but I feel like personal projects is honestly the way to go if you wanna learn coding. I feel like if you try to learn coding and you just try to learn like a programming language, it's gonna be super boring. Like you're not gonna have a fun time trying to learn like Java or JavaScript just like you know just without any sort of context or project surrounding it um you know find something that you want to work on and then learn the languages and frameworks that you need to learn and it's going to make learning coding like so much more fun desk organizing tips please okay so for desk organizing my setup is honestly pretty simple all i really have is water bottle monitors uh, a book it's a couple notebooks my phone my glasses headphones and that's about it i, I don't really have too much Something, bro, what is this? I'm answering questions as I'm playing Minecraft. So uh, once again, ask me any questions you guys have about study tips, homework, college apps, whatever it is, and I will do my best to answer your questions. And ask like interesting, you know, maybe questions that once again, spur some sort of a conversation. Uh, make your day in the life video. I'm not sure if people would be interested in that. Maybe on like a second channel, Messi or Ronaldo, I would say Ronaldo even though I don't really listen to or watch soccer that often. Oh, what do you do when you're stressed? I like that question. Okay, so what do you do when you're stressed? Let's talk about stress for a little bit because stress, I think, is something that we can all relate to. It comes, you know, if you're a student, whether middle school, high school, college, you know, you're gonna be stressed at some point. And let me make my iron bucket real quick. Okay, so I'll kind of answer this. So, okay, the first thing that I think of when I think of stress is I feel like stress comes from inaction, right? It's It comes often, like when you know you're supposed to do something but you're not doing it, right? Like maybe it's avoiding homework, maybe it's avoiding an assignment. In my case, maybe I know I need, I need to make like a video or something, and that will lead to a decent amount of stress. And the way that you solve that is not by telling yourself you have to do the entire thing, right? Because if you tell yourself that, you're just gonna feel even more stress, right? You're gonna be like, oh, I have to write, I have like a huge essay due, right? That's gonna give you some stress. And the solution isn't just to write the entire essay, right? Because the thought of that is just gonna give you even more stress. The solution is to do, I think, the smallest possible thing you can do in that moment to make some amount of progress. So in the case of an essay, right? Maybe just tell yourself, I'm gonna spend 15 minutes, is there a creeper behind me? Oh no, there's spiders. Tell yourself, I'm gonna spend 15 minutes working on an outline and that's it. And I promise you, like doing just the smallest thing you possibly can is gonna relieve, like, relieve so, so much stress. Uh, if it's homework, for example, maybe do just the first problem or even just grab your pencil. Okay, this cave seems promising, but I don't wanna like die. Okay, yeah, okay, I think we're gonna go down there. We're gonna go and try to find diamonds just in case you guys are tuning in. We're gonna try to find diamonds as I'm answering your questions about study tips, about homework. Once again, go ahead and drop your questions in the stream chat. Okay. I, oh, there we go. And we just got hit by a creeper. There's another one right there. 
All right, this is, there we go. That one died before uh, it exploded. Do you guys want me to keep talking about stress? I can't, I have like a few more tips. Um, or do you want, to, want me to answer another question? Just say yes or no, yes, and I'll keep talking about stress. No, and I'll pick up another question from the stream chat. Okay, oh, this, oh, we gotta find dime. Oh my God, okay, so we're gonna have to go all the way down there, and let me see what you guys are saying. Yes, no. No, okay, I think I'm seeing, I'm seeing more no's. Okay, so we'll talk about other, uh, other stuff right now. How do I get motivation to actually study? I talked about this a couple of streams ago. I feel like you can't rely on motivation. I feel like if you're trying to become like a top student, like discipline is key. Like setting a, a certain study block each and every day and just committing to that is pretty much how you're gonna get better grades and pretty much perform better as a student. Um, but there are ways that you can make staying disciplined a lot easier. For example, you can kind of keep your setup like pretty neat and organized so it doesn't feel like a hurdle to clean things up when you have to start work. You can also find like a study partner. Uh, something that I've talked about in the past is get a, uh, creating like an aggressive accountability group chat. So get a couple friends and each and every day you guys have to tell each other like what you wanna get done that day. And then at random points throughout the day, everyone has to check in on each other on like how the progress that they're making on, you know, on what they set out to do. Okay, so let's just kind of go down here slowly. I haven't really been using my shield. I feel like uh, that creeper came up and I could have easily. Oh my God, is that a diamond right there? Oh, let's go. <laughs> nice, okay, so we found diamonds very quickly. I think that's what I heard about like these newer versions of Minecraft is that it's a lot easier to find diamonds. And there's like a new ore, right? It's like netherite or something. Okay, so first of all, you gotta make like an iron uh, pickaxe. So let's go ahead and do that. And let's see, let's go ahead and see what other questions you, we have. And by the way, guys, after this live stream, I'll be hanging out in my Discord server. Link is pinned to the stream chat. Would love to see you there. Uh, go ahead and join if you have not already. Did, 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 what was your favorite subject? I would say my favorite subject was definitely, what is that shining thing? I would say it was definitely math. Uh, if you want me to be more specific, I would say AP Calculus was my favorite class in high school. I just really enjoyed like just conceptualizing like integrations and um, I don't know. I had a lot of fun in that class. Let's keep my like uh, stone in that in my hop bar here. Okay, so let's go ahead and mine these diamonds. There we go. Chloe just keeps saying behind you. Like I keep say I keep seeing you say behind you and. <laughs> Oh wait, oh, low key I thought I heard something drop. Okay, what is the best time to study? Honestly, I, back in high school, I would enjoy studying like right after school. Like I, I would study like through the evening and the night, but I would enjoy getting started like as soon as I came home from school. Oh, and let's go ahead and throw something out. Let's throw out this wool. Oh, there we go, perfect. And we got diamonds. Guys, we are making progress. Uh, we should go down even lower, I think. Yeah, let's, let's just keep going. All right, how many diamonds should we go for? Should, okay, how about this? Should we find more diamonds or should we build a house? Or should we like start a farm or something? I don't know. Oh, how to avoid senioritis. That's a good question. I'll go ahead and answer that in just a second. Let me just go ahead and throw up this poll though. Uh, what should we do? Find more diamonds, uh, build a house, or start a farm or something? What else can you do? What else can you do in Minecraft? Because I feel like if we just find more diamonds, then eventually we can get like enchantments and, you know, go to like the nether and, you know, do all that fun stuff as well. All right, let's see. What do we got? What do we got? Okay, so the next question that I was going to answer was about senioritis. Uh, the last time I was streaming, my brother was on, or not the last time, but a couple, like, like a week ago. My brother was on the stream kind of answering this question because I think it hit him pretty hard. Uh, senioritis hit me hard as well. I think first and foremost is like, to a degree, you kind of just accept it, right? Like senioritis is fine. Like, like you don't like, after you get into college, you're not expected to just like, you know, you don't have to try hard as much. Um, but of course you don't want to get like B's and C's. So I think one piece of advice that I have is to still try to stick to some sort of routine. Like don't let go of your routine. So if you like, set like a study block each day to study, like stick to that, don't let go of that. I feel like it also helps to just remind yourself of the fact that 
if your grades you know start to drop significantly there is a chance that colleges might rescind you um i don't encourage fear-based motivation but i feel like in this case it it might help <laughs> what is this thing uh let's some wool oh it's a glow ink sack whatever whatever that is okay uh let's see what's in the lead right now we have find more diamonds okay cool find more diamonds build a house Nobody wants to see the farm. All right, cool. I, I got you guys. No worries. All right, let's see. How do I get a scholarship? I'll uh, be brief. Okay, cool. Uh, scholarships, use the College Board Scholarships uh, search tool. You can also ask your guidance counselor for local scholarships that are available you know, in your area. I guess it's redundant. Local scholarships that are in your area, yeah. Local scholarships. What other questions do we have? Tip, opinion on debate. I'll be honest, I was in debate club for a solid two days before I uh, stopped. So <laughs> I don't have a strong opinion on debate. I wasn't super involved in it, but um, if you're asking kind of in the context of college admissions, you know, it's a great activity. Did you play any sports? Uh, cross country and track my freshman year, though I did not continue. Okay, so let's see. Does this continue? I feel like this is gonna be a dead end over here. Chloe, now Chloe's saying I'm behind you, nice. All right, let's put down some water. I feel like sometimes you find diamonds at the edge of these like caves or these lava pools, but it seems like there's no luck here. What was the best club you've joined? That's a good question. I was really involved in newspaper club. I enjoyed it a lot because I feel like it balanced out my interest in computer science. Like it kind of brought out like a different side of my personality um, and my skill set as well. Is AP helpful? Yes, I feel, I, you know, if you're kind of in middle school and debating whether or not you should take APs. Let's see. I definitely recommend doing so or just taking the hardest classes that are available. Can you get rescinded for uh, uh, three C pluses for a semester one transcript? Three C pluses. It also depends on the college that you got accepted to. I think three C pluses, at worst, they might reach out. I don't think it's gonna be like a straight rescind though. Like it's gonna raise a minor red flag in my opinion, yeah. Like assuming that you're like usually like an A plus student. Tacky is saying diamonds above you trust. Maybe, honestly. Wait, I think... Oh, we're at negative 49. I feel like you gotta be at, like, 12 to find diamonds. I'm not sure if that's still a thing with, like, these newer versions of Minecraft. I honestly haven't played in, like, so long. Alright, let's go up here. Alright. Oh, there we go. <laughs> More diamonds. Nice. Okay, so... Let me just stand here. As I get another question to answer. Do you know anything about the uh, selective test in Australia? I do not, unfortunately. Is studying for a long time effective? So, people recommend the Pomodoro technique, right? Where it's like you study for 25 minutes and take a 5 minute break. I'll be honest, back in high school I would study for like 3 to 4 hours at a time. Like I... Oh, let me just get some air. There we go. Oh, oh the air doesn't regen instantly. Okay, so I gotta like... Stay out here for a little bit. Okay. Yeah, I was studying for like three to four hours at a time. I wasn't huge and why don't I, I should just mine this directly. And to be honest, for me, I found it effective. But of course, for different people, you know, you might need the breaks more often. I think for most students, though, I would recommend taking a break every hour. But if you kind of accustom yourself to hard studying, then yeah, maybe every couple hours. I really want to block off this water, but I feel like here. Oh god, okay. Let me just do this. Mac OS or Windows. I have both. 
I use Windows for like work, Mac OS while traveling. Oh, there we go. Let's just get some air. This is like such a messy way of doing it. Block the hole. I feel like it's all the way up there though. I feel like if I just kind of try to block off this water path, it's just going to start spreading everywhere. Oh god, okay. What is going on? Let me just break this top block. How do you manage social life and school life? That's a good question. I feel like that's... Oh, there we go. We're in a pocket of air now. Actually, I don't. I hope there's not like a hole beneath this. I'm going to just mine here. And then grab these diamonds. Alright, cool. And let's just peek around. So managing social life and school life. First of all, like study with your friends from time to time, not always, but I mean that way, like you're spending time with your friends, even if you have a lot of school and you're bogged down with like a bunch of work. I also recommend that, of course, you know, on the weekends, also make plans, you know, do things with your friends, try to have fun. But then to a degree, to a degree, you have to realize that you got to make a sacrifice at some point, right? Like there's no such thing as finding like the perfect balance between school and, you know, your social life. Like if you're really focused on school and you're doing all these clubs and you're trying to get into a top college, to a degree, you might not be able to spend as much time with your friends as you want to. And Epic Sports Vids, thank you so much for the 499 Super Chat. Uh, to get into a good college, do you need to have strictly A's and B's or is, or, or is there some wiggle, wiggle room? <laughs> Thanks so much. Love your videos. I mean, by good college, right? I think a lot of people, when they think good college, they think just the top 20, right? They think the Ivies, they think, you know, the US news ranking. But the reality is there are a bunch of good schools that aren't as selective as the Ivies, that aren't as selective as the top 20. So the reality is you can have like, mostly A's and B's, maybe even one C and get into like a decent school. But if you're talking like Ivy tier, then you mostly need just A's to be honest. I feel like even several B's is is kind of tough. Um, like most students have very close to a 4-0, uh, the ones that get into Ivy's. Okay, so we found that diamond patch. Let's go ahead and see do we want to find even more diamonds or do we want to go back up to surface? Let me know what you guys are feeling. Let's see, let's go to a poll. Um, oh, we can do multiplayer actually. We can continue single player or we can hop onto like Hypixel and do like party games with you guys or like build battle and play these other games. Um, uh, what do you prefer? Single player multiplayer all right single player we'll continue with this we'll just keep mining maybe we'll go up and build a house or something multiplayer we'll head over to hypixel and do some party games uh maybe some pvp something else duck thank you so much for the 199 super chat member only discord oh thank you for the reminder and made regionals on history day that's awesome congrats and a uh, duck i will set up the members only discord channel very soon thank you for reminding me and guys, if you haven't already, feel free to join the channel membership. I will be doing members only live streams very soon. Uh, you can join the membership by clicking on, I think the dollar icon in the chat and then uh, clicking on membership or there's something about a membership there. All right, people are saying multiplayer. Okay, so multiplayer, I think it is. All right, Kahoot, we could do Kahoot as well. I think we might do it towards the end of the stream. Because once you start Kahoot, I feel like you guys never want to end, so. All right, multiplayer. Let's go ahead and do some multiplayer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, everyone's going for multiplayer. Cool. Uh, let's do hypixel.net. Okay, so guys, I'm going to wait here in the lobby for you guys to log on and just post your usernames in the stream chat. And I'll go ahead uh, and invite you guys to my party. And in the meantime, I'll go ahead and chat with you guys here all right homework tips uh from chloe okay i have i mean i have plenty i think i'll give you one homework tip though if you can try to start your homework in school like i'm not saying like do it like while your teacher is talking but if you have a few free minutes at the end of class or at the end of the school day for example in homeroom 
just do a little bit of your work so that by the time you get to home or by the time you get home, you just have to keep the momentum going. And like, it's going to be so much easier mentally to start your work because you already started it. Right. And I feel like that's the hardest part when it comes to your assignments. It's something I would do pretty often in school. Uh, I found that it helped a lot and maybe, uh, maybe it'll help you out too. Okay. So let's see a uh, party, uh, material tech, material tech party. What else do we have over here? Uh, able object seven. Oh, they're not online party. Do we have any other usernames in the stream chat? Let me go ahead and see. Uh, mine slayer underscore leadership tips. I have one tip. I feel like sometimes students are too quick to try to obtain a leadership role. Like I feel like they'll join a club and they'll automatically start running for positions and then they'll lose and they'll get, you know, demotivated and then they might quit the club. I feel like like obtaining meaningful leadership roles is going to take time. And that's something that you have to kind of accept going into high school. For example, I wanted to become editor in chief of school, new, uh, my school newspaper. I, you know, stuck it through for like two, three years before I, you know, actually ran and kind of, you know, pulled it together. It's important, but I feel like, you know, play the long game when it comes to leadership. Wait, able object seven, I think. Oh, there we go. Party, any other people online? Let me go ahead and see. Uh, party, tacky, hyper baby. <laughs> Let's see, what else do we have here? Uh, can I join? My user is party V I H A R O A K. KB original, party KB original. Let me see, party list. What do we got going over here? Are we a four people? I think four is actually good. Oh, I'm not an AFK. All right. what to expect for honors math. Honors math, like, is there a specific subject, like honors geometry, honors algebra? Hard to answer that if it's just honors math. Oh, uh, okay, so now we have five people. Party list. Okay, so now let's go ahead and start a game. Uh, I think we can do build battle. We can also do, 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 do what other options do we have here? Smash here? No, it's not as fun. I think build battle. Bed wars. Bed wars, maybe. So build battle or bed wars. Go ahead and post what you guys uh, want us to do in the stream chat. All right, what are the questions we have? Two bed wars. Any tips for psychology majors? My younger brother studied psychology. If you were here, he would give you a much better answer. If you show up to my next stream, I will have him answer this question. But personally, I don't have any like specific tips for uh, psychology. I feel like I'm seeing bed wars. All right. Oh, but do you need like four people for that? Or oh, maybe you do. Let's let's just let's test it out anyways. Let's see what happens. Okay. Cool. Cool. Uh, Solo, 3v3, 4v4v4. Yeah, we should have had four. Um, okay, let's see how this pans out. Maybe someone will get stuck on a different team. Invite to party. Wait, what's going on here? Oh, I clicked on someone. Okay. Ah, party's too big. Okay, can we do solos? Maybe. You kind of be in a party for that. Okay, maybe we'll have to do build battle. I'll do P warp so you can be in the P. Okay, cool. P warp. I'll answer questions in just a second. Well, uh, how do you think of videos? It's been challenging lately because I feel like in the beginning I was doing like just college app tips, then I did a bunch of stuff. Oh, mini games. That could be fun. Yeah, yeah, good idea. And then I started doing like, uh, started doing like study tips, and I feel like there are only so many different kinds of study tips. Which is why you guys may have noticed me branching out a little bit. I did like a um, video about like credit cards versus debit cards. Uh, 
I've, I've done a couple of videos about like fitness, you know, different things. Party games, yep, there we go, joining now. What do you guys think about those videos, by the way? Like, do you guys enjoy like the, the variety? Can I get a shout out? Of course, shout out to Gabriel. Thank you for tuning in. But I feel like the actual ideation process, I don't know, I kind of just sit and think, honestly. Like, I'll just think back to like my times in high school. I'll think about like different, um, I'll look around, just look, look at different objects, see if I can find any inspiration. Uh, but Santa's saying more long form videos would be nice. Yeah, they're coming up. So I have one coming out in the next few days. I already have, I've already filmed the one that comes out after that. And then for Con Squared, my brother and I filmed, oh, the, the game started, wow, I wasn't even paying attention. And then uh, for Con Squared, my brother and I have already filmed our first long form video. So we have, we have a couple long forms coming out soon. Oh, and then I'm also filming another long form video as well. So th th there are plenty coming out soon, don't worry. Cherry is asking Gohar, what grades did you get in middle school? I was a straight-A student in middle school, I remember, yeah. Oh, we missed that one. Oh, it's too late, okay. Oh, well. Yeah, we're not gonna get, like, get onto the leaderboard for this. Alright, what other questions do we have? I do play Fortnite. I don't really play it actively. I played it a little... I played a bit of it recently. Uh, with my friend Dan, some of you guys might know him uh, from our Discord from our Discord server, but I don't play it too often. How to learn JavaScript fast? I learned JavaScript mostly through, I think the basics through Code Academy, but there are also like some YouTube videos that are like four hours long that'll give you like a, a an amazing crash course on JavaScript. Uh, Dan's test prep, yep, yep, Dan's test prep. So, some of you guys already know him, which is awesome. Uh, thank you so much for the $5 super chat, Noah. I'm top three for a fairly niche sport in Canada. I could walk onto Harvard, Dartmouth team. How do I maximize my NCAA position? Grade 10, 1460 PSAT, 3.7 GPA. Um, oh, wow, I'm already getting killed. I'm not even paying attention. To be honest, I haven't consulted any recruited athletes before. I have a friend who might be able to give you good advice. I recommend, here's what I recommend. DM me on Instagram. Um, just let me know that you kind of, you know, gave the super chat, ask this question, and I'll try to give you, uh, find an answer for you. But yeah, if you do a super chat and ask a question and I can't answer, I will do my best to answer. Like just DM me on Instagram and, you know, I'll make sure that I can help out. All right. So we have zero stars so far. Very, very, uh. Very poor performance. A reduction, go hard if you invite me to a party I can host uh, part I can host private games. Oh that that could be fun. Although to be honest. Actually maybe, maybe uh, I'll see after this. Oh, there we go, and we lost. Nice. Alright, what are the questions? Can you play Valorant? I've never played Valorant before. Oh, and by the way, guys, if you have uh, any questions, feel free to join my Discord, post them there, or to DM me on Instagram. Handle is Gohar's Guide. Are you doing another short? Yeah, I'm going to try to think of a short tonight and do one tomorrow. How about we think of one together? How about that? So, like, the, the people that are currently here, like, when I post my short tomorrow, like, you'll know that you contributed. Um, oh, my camera's blurry. Let me go ahead and reset that. Uh, hopefully I don't die. I guess reactivate my camera. There we go. Cool. All right, here. I think we're doing. I'm not really getting hit that often, which is good. Okay, so people are saying, what 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 short ideas do we have? Did you ever wrestle? No. How to study for JE Advanced. I'm actually doing a video where I mention it. Uh, a long form video. You guys will see. A Minecraft short. <laughs> Best AP classes to take. I've done that sort of content before. I just feel like... I don't know. I feel like people aren't super interested in that. Because like not everyone is in AP classes. Oh, oh, and there we go. We just lost. Cooking. 
I did a I did a short where I made like a protein shake. <laughs> I don't think people were like a huge people didn't really enjoy that one that much. I'm thinking like I want like advice that's kind of broadly applicable. So for example, the last kind of academic one that I did was like, should you study with or without music? Um, I was thinking like, should you study at day or night? Something along those lines. But I feel like everyone studies at night, right? Because you come home from school and the day is like already over. So that, I don't think that's really that helpful. Memorization. I was thinking about doing a memorization technique. So I've talked about like, what is it? Chunking before. I was thinking, and I've also done like the loci method. So I could do like mnemonics, though I've also done a video about that as well. So like, I don't really have like any other popular memorization techniques to talk about. One about, maybe one about hobbies? I don't know. I feel like hobbies might not be that helpful though. I feel like a long form video about that could be kind of fun though. We have, we had zero stars this game. This, that's so, uh, so unfortunate. What about business? As in like how to like run a business or uh, can we actually, oh, we're number one right now. Let's keep that at our number two. Okay. You know, I'm not going to look, this game is actually so hard because you just got to like jitter click as fast as possible. So this is like actually very, very stressful. All right. How to make money. <laughs> I have a video, like a long form video where I talk about like side hustles. And uh, spoiler, my next long form video is actually a long, it's like a part two to that. Uh, okay, we are still, oh. Most of the grass is already like, we don't have like big patches anymore. What about extracurriculars? As in like how to decide on extracurriculars. Oh, if you want a video on extracurriculars, I posted one on Gohar's guidebook. Which is like my alt second TikTok account. Or you can find it on Next Admit, uh, the Instagram account. I did like a like a real life video about extracurriculars. It's like two minutes long. Are you guys accusing me of auto clicker? <laughs> I wasn't clicking like that fast. Oh god. Oh, I remember this. Okay, so this one I gotta like. Let me close this off. Oh, there we go. Let's close off this perimeter. Oh no, he closed me off. You gotta be kidding me. Uh, oh no, no. Oh, what, what, what? How is he? No way. Oh, he's okay. So the goal here is to kind of get as many blocks as he possibly can. This guy just kind of. I was trying to close that off so I could just occupy this entire space, but that did not work out. Okay. Here, let's just go ahead and try to do this. We have 26 seconds left. How to become successful in business. I can talk to you guys about like my business a little bit if you want me to, but I'm not sure if that would be as interesting. Oh, there we go, we have one more. We got 91, yeah, we did not do that well. Whoever has green, kind of, the pink. Yeah, this guy absolutely dominated. Like he cut me off like super fast. Okay, so thank you so much for the $2 super chat. Do a short about habits to pick up during high school. Oh, like different, like, like, like kind of like healthy habits slash like productive habits. Is there like a specific sort of, like a specific category of habits that you want me to talk about? Oh my God, okay. Got some parkour here. Oh, not too bad, 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 not too bad. <laughs> there we go, nice. Oh, we actually got something for that, I think. Oh wait, do I do this again or? Okay, cool, I think we, okay, we came in second place. So we finally got two stars, that was good, that was good. And the game is over. I only had two stars, nice. A reduction is saying party, please. Unfortunately, I think I'm going to end the stream here because it's almost 1 a.m. And I've been pretty good about my sleep schedule lately. Like I, I try to go to bed by 1 so I can wake up by like 9. But guys, this was fun. Uh, if you haven't already joined my Discord, once again, the link is pinned to the stream chat. Uh, and if you have any other questions, feel free to DM me on Instagram. 
I'll hopefully stream again tomorrow. And I hope to see you guys here. But if not, um, I'll see you sometime next week for sure. Uh, but yeah, guys, thank you for tuning in. And I will see you again next time.